Quality is amazing. They're not like huge. Look at it. I feel like I'm being strangled. Yes, these do look a bit like a, a tablecloth. One of my favorite tops now. Do you get my vision? Do you not? Gorgeous. Hello everybody, it's me Lee May, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I am coming at you with a Shein haul. I'm not actually sure if you guys really enjoy hauls on my channel or not, but I do have a slight addiction to online shopping, so you're probably going to be getting a few. I have been seeing so many Shein hauls on TikTok, YouTube, it's just gone a little bit viral really. I went on their website and... They have a lot of stuff, a lot of amazing stuff that I want. All the items that I'm about to show you today, all the clothes, they are very, very kindly gifted from Sheen. So thank you guys so, so much. And this isn't sponsored or anything, all opinions on my own. 100% honest. I hope this gives you guys some sort of fashion inspiration. I've just been trying to get more into my style recently and try new things a little bit. Thought I'd experiment a bit and we have got some weird shit in here. But I love it. That is enough rambling on. You clicked on this video to see the clothes. So without further ado, let's get started. The first thing I'm going to show you is this beautiful baby blue sweater. Look how nice this is. I love it. It's just like knitted kind of material. And I love the neck. Little v-neck going on. It has a little skull on it. And it says HCW. And I'm pretty sure like loads of people have this. I've seen it loads before. Like literally loads on Pinterest and stuff. But I actually wore this today over this top. And I made a TikTok with it. So I'll insert that in a minute with the trial clip it is so comfy it's such good quality i just love it i'm a little bit obsessed usually i wouldn't go for something like this like i don't really think sweaters really suit me usually but y'all know i'm gonna be wearing it this is what the jumper looks like on i just love this color i think this is probably one of my favorites not gonna lie it's quite a nice fit it's very very like a comfy slouchy but really cute at the same time it's something you can look good in but also you know feel very comfy in. and you can definitely like layer it up like i i kind of have layered it i've just got like a Play my top underneath. Call me a fashion icon. I just think it's always nice to have a little sweater in your wardrobe, and I never really did because I just didn't think they suit me. But I am, I'm loving this. This next item, I was a little bit unsure about, but I do really like it. I haven't actually tried it on yet, so hopefully it all goes well. I'll let you know what I think in the try on clip. But this top is so gorgeous. I do actually have one really, really similar, which is on my Instagram. Go follow me, I haven't already. They just give off the same vibe, really. I feel like it's a very similar design. That top is like one of my favorite tops. So when I seen this, I just had to get it. So this is just a brown and white mesh. It's very much mesh. It's freaking see through. Long sleeved top. It's not cropped or anything. And this is like the normal length, I'm pretty sure. Like it's kind of long. On the front here we have a little design. It says love you forever. How sweet. This just reminds me of Y2K 90s kind of vibes. More like cyber Y2K actually, but you know, you, you get the vibes. I literally love this. I'm so excited to wear it out. I just wish lockdown wasn't a thing at the moment. I have so many sick clothes and I just want to wear it out. Do you know what I mean? I love this top so, so much. Like right now I've just sort of doubled it up here so that it looks a bit like a crop top, but I do. I love it. I'm definitely gonna be wearing this quite a lot. I don't think I would style it like this necessarily unless I was like just going to school casual because you can wear it like that because it's just like a top. I feel like with some cool trousers or something it would look really good. Maybe some like black leather trousers. Do you get my vision? Do you not? I don't really know but this isn't it till it's full potential. Do you know what I mean? This is it with blue jeans. It's not really that great. It is very very comfy. The material is not like itchy at all and I know a lot of people do get really itchy in mesh material but this is very like soft and comfy to be honest. It is very much see-through but if you was wearing like a cute little bralette underneath you could really pull it off. You could literally wear like a little white vest or something underneath. I am literally loving it. This is at full length by the way. You see? This hop it's so gorgeous. I love it. I don't know how I'm going to tie up the back though. Basically, it's a zebra print top and it's got the tie up back so it's just like open. And I love these types of tops. I think they're so, so pretty. Once again, seeing this top all over Pinterest, like the open back zebra top, love it. My friend actually has a plain black one just like this, also from Shein, and she looks so good in it. And I was like, do you know what? I do need that in my life. Like, I really need it. I mean, I don't know how the tying bit is going to go, but. I'm sure I'll be fine. I feel like this has to be one of my favourite tops now. This is so cute. And it was honestly so easy to just like tie up because it sort of like ruches up when you pull it and then tie it a little knot, you're good to go. I think this is so pretty. Only thing is because of the open back, it would look 10 times better without a bra. So that's the look that I've gone for. I'm just paired it with these black flares for now because just thought they'd look 10 times better than my blue jeans. I think this is a fit, you know, like obviously it is a bit basic, but the top kind of 
you know, it gives it that bit of oomph that it needs. You could definitely dress this up or down depending on like how you're feeling, where you're going. I am literally obsessed. I love this it. next item, it's not my favourite. Um, it's not something that I would usually go for, but the reason I went for it was because of the colour. And I have another item which I'm, I'll show you in a minute, the next one. I just thought they'd go together really well. Turns out they're not the same colour. This top is a one shoulder, like one side is long sleeve, one has nothing. <laughs> Crop top type of vibe. It's got the, um, what, I don't even know how to describe it. You know, the, it, it, it has an inside out kind of look to it. And I think that look is so, so cute. I think these tops are really cute, but on me, they're not my favourite. I don't think they're the most flattering on me. It is still very cute. So, you know what? Give it a go. Why not? Not... 100% sure on it. As you can see, my plan didn't exactly work out, but it's not terrible. So the colours obviously are very, very different. This is more like of a minty green and this is more sage in a way. But I do really like the pieces individually, especially the trousers. I'll talk more about those in a minute. This top, uh, it's not my favourite, but like I said before, these these sort of tops aren't really my style of tops. If I'm getting like a one shot, I do really like one shoulder tops, but if I'm getting one, I usually go for like short sleeve, like... <laughs> Strap. That is probably why I'm sort of leaning more towards I don't really like it. It is a nice top, like it's a good quality and stuff, but I feel like there's a lot of like ex excess material here on my armpit and I hate that. Like a lot of places do that, like with their tops. I just literally hate it so much. It just looks so weird. It just all sort of like bunches up here and it just looks unflattering. And to go with that top, I got these trousers. I think this is zebra print. I'm not too sure, but it's kind of like a sage green kind of colour with white and I've seen these so much on TikTok. I was really unsure on them at first, but now that I have them, I do really, really like them. I think they're so pretty. They're very, very different. Like, I don't have any trousers like this at all. I feel like these are quite a statement piece. I'm definitely a very statement bottom half kind of girl. These trousers, I actually think they're so cute. They are a tiny bit big on the waist, but I sort of like you know, roll them up and then it doesn't, it looks a little bit weird at the front but you can't really tell that much unless you're looking really into it. They're definitely wearable, I would definitely wear them out. I like, I really, really like them. They're actually a really, really good length for me, like they're not too baggy, like they're not like huge, do you know what I mean? I just don't, I can't work out how this work tops, well, I can't seem to work out how this top works but it's one of those like crossover kind of vibes i don't know i'll try and sort it out in the try on clip but it basically just shows a little bit of cleavage and i don't really have much but i just thought you know what day drinks after corona obviously you know don't know how it's gonna go like look look at it i just don't think this is what i expected i'm not really a fan of it i don't i feel like i'm being strangled just a slight bit i'm not sure i mean it's it's cute it's like definitely it's cute we got like an open back moment again we do like it in the back out there's just not much support going on here and overall don't think it's really my vibe so we're, we're just gonna move swiftly on okay i own two more of these exact same things but just in different colors black and white and this is brown brown is very very much in at the moment and i'm not gonna lie i do really like it brown is a color that i was never really into until it was a trend i've got to be honest with you just me the little sheet this is a plain brown is this halter neck i don't really know but it's just a plain brown bodysuit it's very very much like the zara ones everyone has a zara body actually i don't but still. The quality of these is insane. Like when I got the first two, I was so so shocked at how much like the Zara ones these are, and they're like a fraction of the price. I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm pretty sure. Maybe I'm lying. Who knows? I'm so excited to wear this. It's just a basic piece that everyone needs in the wardrobe. Switching up the colours a little bit because I've got black and white. Now I've got brown. I have already expressed a lot of love for this bodysuit. I do, I'm, I'm definitely a fan of it. The quality is amazing, it's unreal, like I said before. It is so, so comfy, so soft. It is exactly like the Zara ones, like literally the exact same. I literally can't fault it in any way at all. Yes, these do look a bit like a, a tablecloth, but I was kind of digging it on the website. These are just some like, is this plaid? This is like a brown and creamy kind of plaid design on these trousers and they're quite long. I do want them to be a baggy fit. I don't know if they will be though. They do feel quite nice quality. Also a little bit like pajama bottoms so actually now I'm thinking about it. They are really nice. I just don't know if they would suit me very much. I don't know if they are very me or not. I think there's a little bit of a love-hate relationship going on here. I can't tell if I like them or not. I feel like they come up a little bit too high for my liking. Like, they look a little bit weird. I feel a bit like Simon Cow. I'm not gonna lie to you. Also do feel like I'm in pajamas. Do you know what I mean? Another piece that I have already worn, so it is a little bit creased just because of that. The fit is absolutely amazing. The quality is so, so good. And it's, it's just simple and cute. It just has a little cowgirl on it. It says cowgirl. It gives me like Brandy Melville vibes. 
Was this inspired by Brandon Melville? I feel like this would literally go with everything. Like it literally does. I've tried it on with so, so many different like trousers, skirts, everything. It goes with each and every one of them. I feel like this is gonna be another one of my favorite. Is it bonfire night though? No, it's not. I'm sorry about the noise, but we're just gonna, we're gonna have to move forward, you know? The show must go on. I love this top. I'm literally obsessed with it. Please shut up. The fit is so, so nice. The quality is absolutely amazing. And I actually really like the length of the top. Like, it's a little bit cropped, but not, you know, so cropped. I feel like you could definitely wear it like this. You could wear it a little bit higher up like I did with one of the other tops. And I still think it looks really, really cute. And you can't really tell that much. It is a big fat yes from me. We've got more statement trousers. These were a very, very last minute decision. Because I have always been a fan of cow print. Like, I feel like even before the trend started, I just loved it for some reason. Me and my friend went build a bear. And we got cows. It isn't super in trend at the moment. But I've seen somebody on Instagram wearing these exact trousers. I fell in love a little bit. Once again, I have worn these already, so if they look a bit battered, that's probably why. And I also have got dirt on the bottom. So these do need to go in the wash, but I wanted to show you in the hall. I went out in the snow in them, and they're, I'm five foot, like I said before. They're very, very long, but I do love them. This is what they look like. They're just like brown and white cow print. They go so, so well with the cowgirl top. Like, that is a fit. And I've also got like a brown hoodie, not from Shein, but I got brown hoodie, it looks great. These were actually really comfortable to wear. They're not the best quality. They are quite thin. Like, they wouldn't keep you like super warm like most jeans do. But I wouldn't let that put you off them because I literally wore them in the snow and I was freaking fine. These trousers, the Calpra trousers, one, first thing, love this outfit. I think it's so, so cute. Like, you, I love it. Like the other trousers, they are a little bit big. So once again, I actually do a different trick for these. I, you know, this little thing like that, bada boom, bada bing, suddenly they fit a little bit better. I do wish the length was like the other trousers though, because these are extremely baggy and they do get dirty at the bottom, like I said before. For some reason, I decided to get two dresses. So this is the first one. It's just a plain brown high neck ripped bodycon dress. But I just feel like it's not really that bodycon. I'm not gonna lie, like, I don't know. It's, it is really comfy. I tried it on already. It's actually a pretty good material. It's like a little bit thin, but it's not thin to the point that it's see-through. I feel like if you styled this well, it would definitely work. Like on other body types as well, it would look banging. But me, a little cardboard box. I mean, it's not the greatest. From the stress, I think I'm getting some mum vibes. I think it's a little bit long. Oh, plenty. Yeah, what is that? I don't think long dresses suit me. Like, I think I look kind of weird in this. I won't lie to you. Like, what do you think? Let me know. I mean, you can turn it up a little bit, but then it goes all weird here. But I think a little bit less lengthy. It would be actually quite cute. It's quite flattering. Like, it does, you know, hug you. Okay. I do love the colour. I love the high neck. I do actually really like it. You know, I take what I said before back. I think I like it. This dress is like a, it has sort of a marble design, pinks, purples on there. I am just not really a fan of one, the fit as well, but also this neck, like, like the shape of this, I just, I don't think it's a vibe for me personally. Don't think this dress is a bit of me. It's just, it's just not. Once again, I feel like it's really, really long. Like, it just doesn't really suit me. It just doesn't really do much for me. If it was a little bit shorter once again, maybe I'd prefer it. Okay, that's a bit dangerous. I think it really is just this area. Like this, I, I don't like it. I feel weird. I think if it was a different cut around the neck and stuff, then I'd much prefer it. I just don't think this neckline is very flattering on me. These last two items, I am sort of questioning up my decisions on why I put them in the order. This is a denim skirt now. On the website, I thought this looked so cute. And the reason I bought this was to go with the cowgirl top because I thought they looked so cute together. Turns out, this just isn't really much of a vibe i don't know it's just not really my thing i don't think i just thought it'd be so cute in summer it is pretty good quality though i'm not gonna lie to you and it's got some like pockets it's got like the frilly bit at the bottom i do like the look of it and i love the whole design and everything but just on me i just don't think it suits me very much i feel like somebody out there would really love this and really freaking pull it off but i just don't think i'd pull it off i do really like the skirt i think it is so so cute i love everything about it apart from the fact that it's on me also i just tried it on with the cowgirl top because that's sort of like the outfit i am vision when I first got it and I do think it goes really well together but I don't know what the what it is with the skirt. You know the light coloured beigey kind of faux leather jacket from Zara. It's like cropped. I've seen so many people wearing them. I kind of wanted that and that is the reason I've chosen this item here. It is my own fault because the beige colour was on the website but I went for this colour because the beige one was sold out in my size. 
I thought they'd be very similar, but this one just actually looks like mustard, so I'm not really a fan of it. I just don't think the colour suits me. I think the jacket is very good quality. Like, I was surprised and shocked at the quality. I think it looks exactly like the Zara one, like the buttons and stuff, just apart from the colour, obviously. This is just a, I'm pretty sure they called the colour almond. Like I say, it's not my favourite thing in the world, but it would definitely keep you warm. But I just don't think it suits me, like, at all. I don't think it needs much of an explanation. That is literally everything I have to show you guys today. That actually went kind of quick. Thank you so, so much to Sheen for gifting me all of these items. Let me know what you guys thought of the haul and the clothes. How you think I can style them? Give me some ideas. Give me some inspo. If you do want some more videos like these, then definitely give this video a thumbs up to let me know. Subscribe if you haven't already, if you're new around here. All of my socials are linked down below, as always, in the description box. And all of these items are as well. Nearly forgot to say that. All of them are down there with a discount code. I am here to get you a bargain. With all that said, I will see you guys very, very soon with a brand new video. Peace.